Today on Cruise Man's Garage, we're installing a Super Brace Fork Stabilizer on this super cool Honda CB1100. The tools you need for this job are a 5mm hex wrench, a 5mm hex socket, a 6mm hex socket, a ratchet, and a torque wrench. Before we start, make sure you have the correct super brace for your year and make and model of motorcycle. It's also a good idea to install the optional fork protectors. Place your bike on the center stand and make sure the front wheel is facing straight ahead. At the bottom of each front fork are two axle pinch bolts. You'll need to loosen these using a 6mm Allen socket. Go ahead and disassemble the super brace by removing the four 5mm hex bolts. Once the bolts are removed, you can separate the two halves of the super brace. Now is a good time to install the fork protectors on the super brace. These will help to protect your fork tubes from rocks and debris and prevent damage. Locate the two small holes on top of the fork brace and use the Phillips screws provided to install as shown. Now we're ready to install the super brace. You want to carefully line up the front half with the top of the fork tubes. Now you want to be very careful when you do this on this bike because there's very little clearance between the front fender and the super brace. Then you want to carefully place the rear half of the super brace. That's the half that has the holes in it so that the two halves line up. Now you may notice this particular owner did not want the fork protectors installed. That's why you don't see them on there. Install the four 5mm bolts that hold the super brace together and hand tighten using a socket. Using a torque wrench, tighten each of these bolts to 10 foot pounds. The last step is to re-torque your front axle pinch bolts to factory specifications. Now pump your front fork several times to make sure nothing's in a bind. 